point when you meet an unknown word first try to guess the meaning from the context the surrounding words and the situation we have the example kids use pcs to do homework access information via the internet for research communication with pals play video games and collect digital music here we have three technical words try to get the meaning from the context what do we find we find pcs internet and digital music so pcs it refers to personal computers internet a global network of computers digital music music that is converted to electronic format we move on to the next we can learn new words through prefixes and suffixes words change their shape by adding them by adding prefixes for example we have net prefix inter and it becomes internet likewise search add prefix re it becomes research we have act prefix interact chips prefix micro and it becomes microchips etc by adding suffixes a store and at the end of it we can add age it becomes a storage in form we can add suffix asian it becomes information likewise invest investment power powerful and so on we move on to the next by lexical family or word class lexical family it refers to the word coming from the same family or from the same word class like noun adjective adverb verb etc like that so look at this example digit is noun we can change this word digit into another word class grammatical category that is digital adjective digitally adverb digitize verb digitizer noun digitized verb so in this way we can also try to learn new words now we have the next by synonyms we can also learn new words with the help of synonyms for example laptop the similar word could be notebook desktop it can be referred to as personal computer tablet it is also referred to as mobile device motherboard is also known as main board or system board or circuit board and so on then we have next point by compounds that is to say with the help of compound words adding two different words together check we have another word book together we make checkbook likewise we have mother board it becomes mother board tele working it becomes tele working micro processor it becomes micro processors so with the help of compound words we can also learn new words and terms now we have by collocations collocations like you can say word partners for example access or access information likewise we have the second word handle handle tasks surf surf the web 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 page again web a browser and so on like that we call such a set of words collocations so with the help of collocations we can also try to learn new terms of computer science then we have next point by word trees and spider grams they can help you build up your own mental maps of vocabulary areas you can make a diagram to classify things so with the help of word trees with the help of spider grams you can also try to learn new words here we have you no know, word trees like we have personal computer and it, it has branch processor and other branch peripherals and then we have ram memory then in we have another way of spider grams like we have peripherals and then it has branch input devices for example mouse we have a storage devices for example hard disk we have output devices for example here printer so in this way we can also try to learn words and make learning new words more interesting and fascinating we move on to the next by using a monolingual dictionary which gives you a lot of information about new words this is the last resort that we take up dictionary to find meaning of the new words for example there is a word laptop it is commonly referred to 
computer a grammatical category is noun and it is countable noun what is the definition a computer which is small enough to be carried around easily reference professional english in use for computers and the internet by santiago ramecha esteras and elena marco faber cambridge university press cambridge uk 2007 hope you understand the lesson thank you and goodbye